Hello everyone, today we're over here by Mount Kraken and we're going to be going after some big whitetail. Also, we just unlocked the moose collar, so I'm kind of hoping we can give that a try and see if we can't get some good bulls to come in and be able to take out with the hawk edge bow. Also, we're going to be looking for some diamond potential animals, so hopefully we can find some. Alright guys, so we just picked up a really heavy buck track, a whitetail deer, 86 to 100 kgs. So that has potential to be a monster whitetail and we are going to track him down and see what he happens to lead us to. We also just kicked up a couple of coyotes over here too, so we'll keep an eye out for them. I don't think we're going to be blasting out the 243 or anything like that, unless we do see a big male. Ooh! This one's 80 to 95, and we also have an 85 to 100 kg whitetail track. So right now we're on two potential diamond whitetail tracks. Alright guys, so we just spotted the one buck here. He looks pretty... Oh, two bucks, two bucks! So... They look about the same, but I don't know if he's big enough to actually go after with the gut, with the hawk edge or not. So I think we're just going to take him with the 270 from here at 160 out. All right, so here we go. It looked pretty good. But at the same time, it looked like it might have been a little bit low as he was walking. He might have walked a little bit faster than I thought, and it might have actually caught and tested. There's the other buck. We might as well take him. That might have been a little bit high in the shoulder blade area. But we'll have to check on that. Oh, yeah, this one's perfect shot. Really good blood here. Yeah, he's down right here. Nice. So he actually ran quite a ways, then hooked around. And started coming back to where he kind of started off here. Let's pick him up. So he scores 124. He's a little bit too small to be gold. We still got left lung at 155 meters. All right, guys. Well, we actually just found the blood from the other buck, and it looks a little bit better than I thought. I thought it was only flesh wound, but it's looking like we at least have intestine. And so let's follow him down here real quick. All right, so here's our second buck down over here. This one ran quite a ways, so I imagine he got hit somewhere in the stomach, stomach intestine area, because he went a little bit further, actually a lot further than the last one did. And this one's probably going to be 130 plus. Oh, 119, so he's a silver. So we got a 119 and a 124, basically the exact same buck. Oh, we hit pretty high. It looks like we just missed the spine. All right, guys, so we just found a gold potential coyote out here. He's a six hard, and he's about 230 meters out there. He's in a bit of brush. But we got the 223, so if we can get lucky enough to get a clear shot, we might go for it. All right, we got him stopped there at 105 meters out. It looks like he might be coming back. Or at least he's going to give it a second look. And we do have a neck shot available. Alright, yeah, he's coming back. He's actually at 100 meters right there, pretty broadside, kind of facing at us. So let's get ready on this coyote. Oh, it looked good. It looked really good. That must be a tough coyote because that looked perfect. Might have hit just a little bit high from the heart, but still, it looked like a double lung shot. Oh yeah, really good blood. You can see it from here. But he might not be gold because of it, though. Yeah, he's down right there. It might possibly be gold if he's big enough. He didn't go too far. I bet we got maybe a double lung or a lung liver shot on him. Or maybe just single lung, but he went down pretty fast, so let's take a look at him. That's a good coyote. And let's pick him up. Nope, he's silver. He for sure would have been gold. He was a 50 score. It would have been my biggest coyote, but we only got one lung. It looks like we just hit a little bit too high. Still a pretty awesome coyote. And we got 1,317 cash for it. 
228 XP, a total score of 762. Yeah, it was 99 meters and we reserved him for 150. So I think that little difference is what changes Coyote from being a silver to a gold. All right, guys, well, we just found a really big black bear. He's a seven very hard. And I think we're going to try and just use the... Hmm. I wish we had the seven millimeter, but we don't. I think we're just going to use the... 338 on him. <laughs> Dropped him. So it's not going to give us 100% integrity, but it will show us a score. And so we'll be able to at least see what it would have scored if it would have been potential to be diamond, but I know it wasn't. So rather than try and get really close and make a good hit with the 270, we just pulled out the 338 and let it do its job. Plus, we want to try and get back on this big bucks track anyways. So we don't want to spend too much time over here by this black bear. Let's pick him up. So it was a 20 and we still got silver on him. You can see it's a zero integrity bonus because we used a 338. We got a double lung hit on him and 1,273 cash. So we still got a ton of cash and made a really good shot. Overall score of 678. He probably would have made gold for sure. Alright guys, we just kicked up a coyote and there she is running there. I thought that first one looked like a good hit, but apparently not. It was pretty cool. All of a sudden you could see something barreling through the grass over here. It was making a tunnel. And right out in the front of it, you could see... The... That thing is still running? You gotta be kidding me. Still got some blood here. Oh, here he is down right here. So, I'm almost wondering if we shot at two different coyotes. I thought I saw him run off that direction over there. I think that was a doe that just took off. Double check. Yep, it's just a doe. Alright, let's pick up this coyote. No, it was the same one, and it was actually a decent male. We hit it in the intestines the first shot, which I thought would have brought him down. And eventually it did, but you can see right here, the 270 still... Oh, we're using the 223. I totally forgot that that was a 223. So it's actually a really good thing that we didn't use this gun on that um, very hard black bear because this 223 wouldn't have done much to it unless you made a perfect spine shot. All right, guys, we got a coyote on the run out here. I don't know why we didn't reload, but we put one hit on that coyote. We used the 223, but it didn't get hit very good. I don't see it anymore though. There he goes. Oh, he turned. Can't even hardly see him now. We're just throwing some lead at him out there, but yeah, he's not gonna go down from that. Well, I think when we were just spraying and praying through the brush, we actually got lucky and caught him. Because he's down right here. I have a feeling that one of those shots that we took definitely did the job. Because that one went to brought him down. Let's take a look. Yeah, we actually caught him in the left lung running at 246 meters through the brush. Couldn't even see him. And we let him about just right. We are holding it somewhere above the head when we were zeroed in for 150. And I can't believe that that shot actually hit him. Well, that goes to show that you can't get him if you don't try. And... That coyote would have ran a long ways if we wanted to take that shot. So I'm really glad we actually did and we actually got 1,214 cash for him. It was a bronze, but it was a pretty decent one. Alright guys, well we just found our buck. And he's big. That's a 150 plus right there. Can't quite tell how big he is. He he could be diamond, but it's really hard to tell. Either way, he's a big buck, and we're going to try and get him with the bow. See him? He's popping up over this edge over here. He's right there. 
37 meters out, but we got a lot of wind, so it's a little bit risky to take that far of a shot. We could definitely do it. We might have to. Oh my god, he's right there. Oh, hit him a little bit high. No, maybe not. Perfect. All right, we just got a monster buck down. So I just saw him over there and he was 40 meters out. And we went prone and popped back up. He was literally 15 meters away or less. And we might have just got a diamond buck. This thing is huge. Look at the rack on that buck. Well, if he's not a diamond, he's gonna be close. All right, well, let's pick him up. So he scores 146. He was a gold, and we made a left lung hit on him. So not quite a diamond, but he's still a monster whitetail buck, and it was a long track job to get him. So he actually weighed 86.8 kgs. He was kind of on the bottom end of what his track said. The track said he was 86 to 100 kgs, and probably if he was closer towards 100, he might have scored closer to a diamond. But he's still a great buck, and I think that's going to be the end of this video. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you next time.